Hey guys, it's Lee and welcome to Jenny's Diagnosis episode 11. Yes, I am still ill. Today's video is just a short and sweet update about my pain and my mood after my diagnosis and that's pretty much all I have to say on the matter. If you're not caught up there will be a link down in the description to the JTD playlist so you can go watch any of the instalments you may have missed and so you're not confused about anything going on in this video. Anyway, I hope you enjoy episode 11. I'm EDS updating. So there's a bit of mess that I'll clean up at some point but like I can't stand up right now. Um, it took me long enough to get down the stairs. Like it took me like five minutes to get down the stairs, which doesn't sound like that long, but I butt shuffled because if I'd have walked, I wouldn't have made it because I feel like I'm gonna pass out. I was gonna go to college today, but I physically can't and my hand isn't functioning anyway. So it'd be really, really hard for me to write and stuff. I'd have to take my keyboard with me or even my laptop, but that's just hassle. And I don't think my phone has enough charge like whenever i use my bluetooth keyboard my phone just like dies really quickly it's a good job i'm ambidextrous like i can write with my left hand i can i can do i do everything with my left hand I'm not using eds as an excuse not to go in if my legs didn't feel so useless i'd be there right now there's not much point in me being like oh i can still like function with my left hand when my legs won't function so yeah we're being a lefty today but if i use this hand too much my shoulder hurts because i have a bad shoulder i always thought it was a gymnastics injury turns out it's just eds and also gravity if i go to pick something up even if i'm only lent over like this far i can already feel my shoulder ripping out of joint but yeah i just thought i'd update you i've been off for two weeks and i was like yesterday i was like i feel good i feel good great but i feel good i can go to college hi <laughs> Seriously, I need somebody to like come take care of me. But like a personal assistant. I don't know I'm gonna like that. Ah, oh, fudge. I don't know I'm gonna like the stove. Hang on. Use the palm of my hand to push the button. Nope. Whoa! That hurt more than I care to admit. <laughs> I've got like no strength in my hand of my wrist. There we go. Right, I've worked out how to get down here by bum shuffling. How the fuck am I gonna get back up with a cup of tea and noodles? I didn't get that far. All right, I'll be back. <sighs> Everything clicked. I just felt my back crack. That was fun. <sighs> Why do I stick this on the f like? I've put I've put it to cook on the one that's furthest away. Less chance of setting myself on fire, I guess. Oh, I didn't put the timer on. Oh shit, I'm cooking the packet. Oh, <laughs> I'm just cooking the seasoning. There you go. This happened. Um, it's gonna taste like melted plastic now. Oh well, right. What was I saying? Yeah, we went for a birthday meal for my brother, which like drained me. Mentally and physically, because I have to sit with my grandparents, and we all know. We all know. I don't know. Not these days. Brain fog and shit. Um, so they don't like me, because I'm too independent, and I have opinions, and children should be seen and not heard. My grandparents are very, very old-fashioned. And uh, so that was mentally draining. And then yesterday, we I had to get up. I hadn't slept. I slept from like four till half seven and then i had to take squidge to see moana controversial opinion not really a huge fan of moana i think it was a bit of a letdown because like three of the songs were the same song Ugh. and like i felt like i was being cheated a little bit by disney um but you know, that's cool i really like the rock so that kind of helped I've just popped my hip. Oh my, wow. It's been a while since the right one's gone. It's usually the left one I've got problems with. So yeah, I'm like insanely tired. And I've done nothing, really, when you think about it. Like, that that is a busy schedule for me. But like, average Joe would be like, well, I'm bored. That's not a social life. Fuck you, Joe. 
All right, I'm gonna try and get back upstairs now um, and throw away the packet that I cooked. Oh, ew. I wanna collapse. I'm genuinely, I think I'm gonna collapse at some point today. Right, I'm gonna go watch Love Check Charge because I'm obsessed with George. Just gonna put it out there. That's just that is it for this video, guys. If you like to be sure to give it a big old thumbs up, as well as me, links down in the description. So make sure you go follow me, subscribe, and I'll see you next time with a brand new video. Ciao. Mwah. Bye.